The worldwide outbreak of COVID-19 has hugely affected the biosphere negatively. Since 2019, it has already infected 42.3 million people as of now. These occurrences are caused by human activities such as hunting, butchering, and as well as the global trade of animals and domestication of exotic animals as pets. Humans have played a significant role in the contagion and widespread of the said virus. The transmission of the virus generated through droplets when an infected person coughs, sneezes, or exhales. Because of its mode of transmission, strict protocols were implemented causing indirect effects to subsystems. As such, both positive or negative, classifying the indirect impacts of COVID-19 as subsystem and identifying irrespective problems thereof are crucial in furthering the cause of saving Mother Earth. The COVID-19 pandemic has a positive and negative effects on the subsystems. Streets have emptied of people and vehicles. Factories have shut down and flights have been grounded. In China, satellite images have shown a significant drop in nitrogen dioxide pollution. There has been a significant decrease in the amount of harmful gases in the atmosphere. In hydrosphere, the waters became cleaner and crystal clear, just like in the canals of Venice. Reduced levels of pollution have given underwater systems a chance to rejuvenate themselves. However, problems continue to persist in geosphere. The rising demand for online shopping, both perishable and non-perishable goods, has increased the accumulation of inorganic wastes. Such wastes include a lot of plastic packaging, especially on foods, which are mostly disposable and are detrimental to the environment. There are several everyday precautions you can take to help avoid infection. Some of the preventative measures to take are Stay at home as much as possible. Avoid touching your eyes, mouth, and nose. Wash your hands with soap and water for at least 20 seconds. Avoid non-essential errands. But when you need to, wear a mask and a face shield. Practice social distancing by keeping six feet away from the others. If possible, avoid large crowds. Bring hand sanitizer containing 70% of alcohol and sanitize your hands regularly. But to also prevent the damage of the geosphere, be responsible in disposing your trash and waste. According to Jerome Adams of the United States Surgeon General, people should stop purchasing non-biodegradable medical face masks. Disposable face masks can do more harm in the environment than protecting ourselves from COVID-19. If you live far away from the COVID-19 hotspots, it is much better to use reusable masks to lessen disposal waste. Indeed, there's a lot of things to stop the spread of the virus. Keep in mind that our enemy can't be seen by our naked eye. So to the rules and regulations, we must comply. The indispensable lesson gained from this experience should strengthen our sense of responsibility. Not just by fueling personal satisfaction and safety, but for the greater good of everybody.